making their voices heard. Demonstrators rallying outside the Manitowoc County Courthouse, showing their support for Stephen Avery and Brendan Dassey. Good afternoon, everyone. I'm Vince Vetrano. And I'm Bridget Shanahan. Also expected at the rally are those who believe Avery is guilty. Pete Cervaca joins us live with a look at what's happening right now. Pete, looks like a lot of people behind you. Definitely, Bridget. Uh, things actually got heated earlier. We had a group of people who believe Avery is guilty yelling back and forth with a group of people who believe he is innocent. Now, I'm going to step out of the frame, let you see what's going on. As you can see, we've got some protesters still standing on the steps of the courthouse holding signs. Periodically, we'll hear cars passing, beeping their horns in support. Earlier, some protesters actually entered the courthouse, but deputies inside say they were peaceful and have since cleared out. Those protesters say they're here with a message for Avery and Dassey. I just want to tell Stephen, Avery, and Brendan Dacey that we care about them, that we believe that they had an unfair trial. DNA proved he was guilty the second time here, and he should rot in jail if he never gets out because, so help me, if he gets out, there's going to be some other woman that's going to be a, at risk. Joe Buenzo was one of the protesters we met who says he thinks that Stephen Avery is guilty. Now, we just were briefed a little bit before the show from Manitowoc PD. They say they estimate the crowd here, including the media, at 100 people. Live in Manitowoc County, Pete Zervakis, today's TMJ4.